All right, so Dying Light. It's honestly a good game besides like all the glitches. If the glitches were gone, then it would actually be like a perfect game. This stuff, it's just, it's a good game. Like, I don't know what else to say. It's a good game. It's just, what, like, the thing I love about Techland, they they listen to the community and, like, um, other uh, games. But besides that, Techland listens to the community and gives them what they want. That's what I love about Techland, man. That's what, so they're fixing, they're fixing Dying Light 2. I, I don't know when it's, the update's gonna come out, but I know they're doing it, bruh. As, you know, like, the tech line is honestly just awesome. Like, I love the games. I love the games they made. Like, it's awesome. I love uh, Dying Light, like the franchise. I got into do introduced to it by one of my friends. He, I don't, I don't actually don't even know where he's at anymore. I haven't talked to him in like a few years, but I mean, we used to play Dying Light all the time. And then while we were playing it, we do like glitches and stuff and it would be really really funny but then now since dying light 2 is out i don't even know where he's at his playstation might got like destroyed or something or i don't know he just doesn't come on anymore which is kind of kind of sucks but other stuff dying light 2 is awesome like the stud the campfires on the rooftops that just makes dying light just dying light it just shows how, like, how the survivors are trying to survive. Nothing really else to say. I can, like, you can see how much time they put into this game. Like, look at the graphics, it's awesome. It, they're like, they released it at a good time. It's just awesome, because... Dying Light is, it's just my favorite game. I've been playing the game for a super long time. I wouldn't say like super, but like a long time, basically. And I just, I love the game. It's like one of my favorite games. And the missions in Dying Light 2 are just awesome. I, lo I love the missions. It's just sometimes when I'm doing the missions, it glitches out. And I'm not being able to, you know, do stuff, but... You can see some of the fighting stuff. It's the clean. Like, he's good. And I'm just super glad that Dying Light 2 didn't turn out as, like, cyberpunk, you know? Of how it's not, like, incredibly buggy. It's, like, it can be fixed kind of buggy. Cyberpunk, I don't know if you can fix that. Well, I'm not a developer, so I wouldn't know. It's pretty, like, it's not as buggy. It, it can be fixed, like, pretty easy just by quitting the game or closing the app. Or closing the game. But. Anything else, I haven't really experienced any other bugs besides floating characters. And, you know, stuff not happening. Or stuff that just can be fixed by exiting the game or closing the game and reloading it while i'm playing this i was actually kind of lost in the middle i didn't have to kill these guys but i just ended up doing it because i thought that was my mission god damn this is one of the glitches where I had to quit the game because it said I still had the mission to open the door, but I really just couldn't. I'll speed this part up a little bit. I just really enjoyed the story of Dying Light 2. 
I haven't finished it yet, but it's it's going really good so far. I love it. And this is me experiencing another glitch where I cannot place the C4. I spammed the square button as fast as I could, but I, 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 I just couldn't. And then when the timer hit zero, it didn't even blow up, it did nothing. Then, here I am again. Had to re repeated the same mission, and then it worked. Well, this is the end of the video, hope you enjoyed, and, um, well, bye.